Hey, salut à tous Aujourd'hui, on se retrouve sur GTA pour vous présenter le nouveau DLC, donc, euh, qui s'appelle le raid de la ferme de Clocking Bell. Euh, donc, euh, bah, quand vous arrivez dans le jeu, vous avez un appel de Vincent. Euh, ce qu'on va faire, comme à chaque fois, on va se faire les petites missions. Donc, il y en a 6. Dans cette première partie de vidéo de ce DLC, vous verrez donc les deux premières. Donc, comme à chaque fois, avec un montage assez propre, des coupes de partout pour que vous ayez juste euh, les moments importants et où aller et quoi faire et tout pour que vous compreniez si vous voulez réaliser les missions. C'est un DLC qu'on n'attendait pas trop parce que d'habitude, c'est quand même euh, deux fois dans l'année. Euh, voilà, une fois l'été, une fois euh, au moment de Noël. Euh, donc voilà, bon bah c'est un petit truc, ça va assez vite, vous allez voir, hein, moi j'ai tout fait tout seul, ça se fait relativement bien, donc euh, n'hésitez pas à me dire dans les commentaires si vous avez kiffé ce DLC, puis si vous avez des questions sur comment réaliser une mission, je serai là pour répondre, je vous laisse avec ce gameplay, je vous souhaite une bonne vidéo, si vous êtes prêts, moi aussi, allez go Is going inside. Not with your reputation for depravity and general aversion to the law, in all seriousness. Your countenance is quite discernible, and there are certain of my consociates who would take it upon themselves to exercise their right to lethal force where they too encounter you in person. But it's good to cross paths with you again, my friend. After head of security at the Diamond, this isn't exactly what I had in mind, but it's still a long way from a mall cop, right? Let's take a walk. Relax. I'm a cop, but I'm not a cop. This is just where the universe put me right now. I mean, I have my path and you have yours. And quite frankly, I don't give a damn about your antics out there. In fact, we may be able to assist each other. I mean, check this out. You see that misguided individual? How do you think he's gotten away with selling drugs in front of that burger shop? Very conspicuously for 10 years now. In front of the largest department in the city. He cuts them in. Effenberger, you copy? Yo, Effenberger. I copy. Worst last name ever, dude. <laughs> I mean, Effen what? <laughs> anyway, when you got five, we all need some Effen coffee down here on Dix. And don't forget the Effen cream and sugar. Copy that. All these motherfuckers. Huh? I'm out here getting coffee for cops on the take. And that guy over there is only a modicum of the issue. There's a new cartel running a large-scale cocaine operation out of the Cluck and Bell factory in Polito Bay. And being no doubt, the cops, they're not only turning a blind eye, they're actively facilitating. If you ask me, the cartel and the cops can both go to hell, preferably on the back of the same bullet. I'm talking about a surgical strike, man. Taking out the whole operation. That's why I came to you. Let's go somewhere a bit more unfrequented. I understand your motivation in these matters. If you raid that factory, anything you find is yours to keep. But this isn't about the drugs for me. This is about these assholes running the biggest protection racket in the state. That's the kind of status quo I cannot abide. As far as my part, I can provide all the intel you need. Records, names, locations. We will need to educate ourselves on the factory, though. Gather materials so you can attack it with style and aptitude. Ding fucking dong, Officer Effenberger. We're effing falling asleep over here. Get us some effing coffee. Copy that. I'm on my way. Think about it. If anybody deserves to be fucked with, it's these guys. Can I count you in? Excellent. Now on to the first order of business. Acquire some funds. And fortuitously, we have files on some money laundering operations not far from here. The department allows them to operate for a share of the profits. I suggest we take a more proactive stance. <laughs> Time to do what you do. I'll call you. Let me take these fucking assholes their coffee. Next is stolen cash. I invite 
you to consider this as a double investment opportunity. I hope life's treated you well since we last worked together. I say that because you have an indeterminate experience. By the way, I will be able to assist you with my LSPD privileges. Accessing their database and communications is a perk of the job. One that will prove useful throughout this venture, I'm certain. Okay, pure simplicity. Get inside, get the money, get out. They out to get you? Can't say I'm surprised. I'ma kill you, and I'ma kill your sister. Hey, bitch! after Exhibit A. I will fuck you up, motherfucker! <laughs> For a fight, pussy. Oh, 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 oh. You're fucking dead. So while you're hard at work, allow me to explain some of the background to our endeavor. A few months ago, a new cartel arrived in San Andreas. They came up with a pretty smart plan to get their operation up and running. Pay key employees at Cluck and Bell to look the other way while they use their distribution network to move 
loose. Once upon a time, it was an FIB facility, then the LSPD for a while. Now it's disused and wonderfully off the radar. A perfect storage locker for our operation. Hey, it's me. That was a lucrative effort. This is a solid fund to use on the rest of our planning efforts, the first leg of which I'll get to work on right now. I'll be in touch. All right, let's discuss a potential way into this place. The cartel are paying off employees a cluck and bell to use their factory as a cover. There are a couple things we'll need in order to solidify my current infiltration plan. Let's move. Sending the relevant coordinates to you. I have a checklist for today's operation. Number one, a laptop from a Cluck and Bell employee on the cartel's payroll. It's got critical intel for our operation. Number two, a hacking device which is going to help us pilot a train. And that brings me to number three. We need a train. That's how we're getting into the factory. Find it? Good work. Keep the device accessible. We're gonna need it. Confiscate the laptop. Later. Someone's on the rack. Excellent. This should tell us exactly when we need to hit the factory. Someone's pocket. Remember, these guys are serious. They will not hesitate to shoot on sight. Take whatever steps you deem necessary. Suppose. 
Perhaps you're familiar with the schematics of the train signal network. No? Then just follow the instructions on the hacking device to change the signals as you approach them. You need to keep that train moving at all costs. If you miss your shot, the emergency brakes will kick in and you'll be sitting ducks. Okay, progress update. The train you acquired has been discreetly relocated into storage, where it will remain until the day of the raid. Things are coming together. Next on the to-do list, acquiring weapons and gear, or the getaway vehicle, your choice. <laughs> 